All right, Cub, we gotta head home, okay? It's been a long day. All right, it's been a long day. Uh, I am I am also tired. It's literally not even been a whole day yet. It's still like literally 2 p.m., but I'm exhausted, okay? We started early, okay? We started early, I'm done, I wanna go home. <laughs> that being said, we'll take the long route because driving is, it's pretty therapeutic, okay? It is pretty therapeutic, let's be honest. Ooh, okay. Uh, it's, it, ha it has been a long day though. I. Like, we started, like, almost 5 a.m. Yeah, honestly, I hope we don't have any sort of road rage incidents. <laughs> Anything like that. No idiots on the road while we're going home, please. <laughs> Yo, okay, dude, I have a story to tell you. You know this hospital over here? The one just right there? You may not know it, but that thing's been abandoned for years, dude. Literally, literally years. It's been abandoned, yeah. Like, hold on, let me pull over to the side of the road here. So, in, like... Obviously, it's it's like 2022 now, right? So this thing like got abandoned in like 2008 or 2007 or something like that. So it was years ago, um, and I'm pretty sure they they spent like millions of dollars building the thing in, for uh, in like 2003. So the year I was born, they built it, and then in 2006, 2007, I can't remember which one exactly. Um, it completely shut down no one really explained why so they leave all the lights on this still has power because they use it they technically they have it under like this weird uh name or like this weird law almost of like uh basically like it's it's to be used as an emergency hospital if there's something to happen like a natural disaster or whatever you know there's still working equipment the lights are still on and all that kind of thing but it has been abandoned for so long yeah it's so cool we should come back tonight we should like check it out like, we want, we should do it at night. It'd be freaky. It'd be kind of cool. Like, I mean, like, that would be super. Imagine, like, going through an abandoned hospital at night. That'd be so freaky. <laughs> I just, that'd be really cool. All right, we'll, we'll go tonight, then we'll go tonight. We'll go home. We'll get some sleep. We'll wait for it to turn night. And then, uh, they're going to video. Okay, you know, if you want to videotape it, you can. I'll hold the flashlight. You hold, I'll hold, <laughs> I'll hold the flashlight. You hold the camera, you know? Um,. Right, we'll go home, we'll get a few hours of sleep before it turns night, and then that way we won't be quite as exhausted when we're going through, but it's really cool. I just I just thought it was sick, so we're gonna do that, okay? Alright, uh here, we'll we'll stop in here, we'll get some hours a few hours of sleep, and then we'll we'll come back out at night, okay? You need to unlock it. <laughs> I can't get in without you unlocking it. There we go. Okay, great, fantastic. Alright, I'm going to bed. I'll see you tonight. Oh, okay. Uh, Cobb, are you? Oh, you you are. Cobb, wake up. Okay, I don't know why you slept on the couch. There's quite literally a bed through there. Okay, but uh, it's late now. It is currently, um, you know, just about seven. So being winter, it's pretty dark out. You ready to go? I mean, I'm ready to go if you're ready to go. Okay. Can you hurry up? You should have done this 30 minutes ago. Come on. You want to set an alarm? Like, <laughs> all right, let's go. I'm not going to hang around. Okay. It is, yeah, okay, this is gonna be so freaky. This is, this is actually gonna be so terrifying, dude. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you right now. I am already a little freaked out. Strangely quiet, it is extremely dark. I, I am kind of freaked out, but yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'm sure it's, I'm sure it's just, you know, everyone's, uh, everyone's just doing something, you know? I mean, it's, it's it's only seven, right? So some people might still be coming home from work and all that kind of thing. I don't know. I mean, it's not super late. People could be out for dinner or whatever, you know? Like, I will give you that. It is weird. It's so freaky. Okay, hold on. We'll park here because I don't want to, I don't want to go in just yet. I, I'm just, <laughs> I don't know. I'm freaked out, bro. <laughs> okay. I think I prepared myself enough. I think I'm good. I think I'm good to go. <laughs> Took me a minute, but I, I think I'm okay. Oh god, this is freaky, dude. This is so freaky. Dude, look at that. How do we even get in? I don't want to break a window or anything. Dude, it's it's empty, bro. It's a, dude, it's it's literally empty. Wait, it's on Oh, yo. Okay, it's unlocked. So the lights are Okay, we don't have to have the flashlight. Out. The lights come on at night. Dude, this is freaky stuff, bro. This is so weird. What? Dude, this is insane. Everything's still in like pretty good condition too, which is quite surprising. I mean, the computers, you can tell they're old. Like, I mean, look at look at the shape of them. <laughs> like, yeah, like this is insane though. This is really cool. This is like actually sick. I kind of love it. Okay, we need to, 
we need to go upstairs because I'm pretty sure that's where all like the surgery stuff is at. Like I'm pretty sure they did all like the surgery stuff on the second floor. So I think that'd be kind of cool to look at. Yo, dude, this is this feels so sketchy. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah, look, surgery. Dude, this is crazy. Did they do like, I mean, this is a weird setup for a surgery. Like just having two people f like facing one another. I wonder what they were doing in here. Yeah, I mean, maybe, but I just, it seems like a weird setup, honestly. Okay, uh, okay, we can go down to the other end. Dude, look at this banister, too. That's, that's pretty freaky. Well, yeah, I just, I thought that was you, because you were behind me, so. No, don't play with me right now. We're in an abandoned hospital, okay? I'm not gonna, I'm not falling for your tricks right now, Gub. <laughs> Dude, we were in a surgery room. You're telling me you didn't just, like, move something or drop something? Okay. All right. Look. Stop. Okay. I'm sure it's it's just it's an old building. Okay. I'm sure it's fine. Okay. It's probably just something falling over because we've come in here. We've let in a draft. We've opened doors and things like that. That hasn't happened in years. All right. I'm sure it's just old and things are moving. Okay. I'm sure it's fine. I know you're spooked out, but we're almost there. Okay. We're like we're we're almost done anyways. There's no point quitting now. I mean, it is freaky. Don't get me wrong, but. We're almost at the other end, so this is kind of cool. I mean, yeah, like, this is so freaky, dude. This is so cool. I love this. I mean, like, we... Really, this is insane. Like, this is nuts. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Who are these? Oh, they have knives! Yo. Uh. Whoa. 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 Okay. What do you mean, run? What do you... Run? They have knives! They're just... Okay, no, I'm come. I'm going after you. No, 100%. Yeah, let's go. Let's let's just go. Let's just go. Uh, let's it's fine. I'm sure we're good. Dude, oh my god. Okay. Uh, where's the exit? Where do we where do we get out? I forgot. Down this way. Okay, okay. Bro, are they even are they even chasing us anymore? I'm not 100 percent sure if they are. Ah! Okay, <laughs> they are. They are. They are. They are. <laughs> oh my god. Get up, Cub. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get to the car. Get to the car. They didn't. They didn't chase us out. They didn't. Ch I'm getting in the car. I'm locking the doors. <laughs> no, I'm just gonna lock the door. Screw that, man. <laughs> I'm not dealing with that right now. Okay, call the cops, I guess. They've got, I mean, they're sitting inside there. They're not coming out. I wonder why they're not coming outside. Like, we, they could have literally chased us to the car. Why are they just sitting there? What are they doing? I mean, turn my lights so we can see a little better, but. Oh, cops are here. Or a cop is here. Dude, are, okay, are you okay? Honestly, I, I saw you I, I saw you trip on ice or something, so... Bro, why didn't they chase us out here? That's so weird. Okay, just uh, just try not to move it too much. Hey. <laughs> uh, did you guys call the police? Yeah, um... There is four people with knives inside. They, uh, they, they chased us. Okay, they chased us. How many... Yeah, there was four of them. They chased us with with like knives they were they looked super raggedy they almost looked homeless um i mean that's a really weird description to give them. i'm gonna say they looked homeless um they looked homeless. top floor um that's kind of where they were at they're on the top floor i'm not 100 sure where they're at right now because they did come down to the door so yeah there was there was four of them on the top floor they chased us down with it look yeah you can see them look Look, dude, like, you do you not see him? Like, I swear to God, there was someone just standing there. Oh, my God, dude, this is, this freaks me out, dude. We just got chased with knives. That's freaky, dude. Are you okay? Uh, she hurt herself. I don't know what she did exactly, but she do be, she do be hurt. Dude, they're literally, they're standing right at the door. Like, that's weird. That is weird. That is really weird. You got EMS on the way. Fantastic. Okay. Have a seat for me. All right. Sure. Yeah, no. You're not the only one, Cub. Like, I'm, I'm literally freaking out right now. We actually just got chased by, like, four people with knives. Four people. Are you okay, though? Because I did see you go down pretty hard. So. Yo, wait. Oh, they've got them in cuffs. I mean, okay, look, I'm sorry. I don't mean to, like, point at the obvious, but they've got people in cuffs. There's one there, and then there's they're still inside. Although they are... They are kind of giving up pretty easily, so I'm not too worried about it, but... 
Yeah, I'm... I'm gonna go up and just ask what's going on, okay? I'm just gonna go look at the door. Uh... Okay, I do just kind of want to peek inside the window a little bit. I'm not gonna go... I'm not going inside or anything. I just want to peek. Yo! I mean, look at that. They have one per... One, two... Three! Ah! Okay, three. Yeah. Three, four... All four of them in cups. Cubs, sit down. Stop. Stop trying to move on your leg. Jesus. They've got all four of them in cups right now. Trespasser. You don't... You don't own the hospital, dude. If I may ask. I mean, may, may or you're not. <laughs> uh, what were you two doing in there? It's abandoned. So we wanted to check it out. Like, that... I mean, sure, we were technically trespassing, but I'm not going to lie to the cops either. We just wanted to take a look and see. Like, it, it didn't seem like that big of a deal at the time, so... These guys chased us with knives, like... They broke in before you guys. Oh. Maybe that's why the door was unlocked, Cub. It was supposed to be locked. Uh, it was unlocked. Like, it was, it was definitely unlocked when we got there. Yeah, seriously, get him away from... Jesus, dude. The, he was the guy that chased us with knives. You're putting him right in our face. Freaky stuff, dude. Freaky stuff. Um, are you okay? Uh, I... Yeah, I'm okay. I'm, I'm shaking up. I'll give you that, but I'm fine. We're gonna have to detain you until we resolve this. Absolutely not. You're not detaining me. I did nothing wrong. Are you ridic... You're being ridiculous right now. You're not detaining me. Absolutely not. Detain me for what? Like, getting chased with a knife? Are you serious? Dear Lord. Okay, so they're taking a look around now. Okay, this is fine. Oh, boy. <laughs> uh, so, talk about a story to tell, Cub, huh? You know, like, all those, like, stories, like, those horror stories that we listen to? Like, we're going to be on one of those. You know that? That's literally going to be, like, that's going to be our story on there. <laughs> like, ooh. Yeah, that's painful to watch. I'm sorry, but I can't watch that. Okay, you're you're gonna have to deal with this one on your own, Cub. Dear God. Uh, okay, so she's highly likely going to be transported to hospital because she'll probably need to get something for that foot, um, or the ankle. And then I, on the other hand, I'm going to leave because this is awful. Okay. Cub, I'll uh, I'll I'll come and see. Oh, you're just gonna. Okay, yeah, you're just gonna leave. Okay. We're just both going to leave the scene. All right. I guess that's how it is. All right. We're leaving. We're done with this. I didn't want to be part of that anymore. Bro, we just got chased by four different people. They looked... I think they must have been like squatters or something. You know, they must have been like living there for a while. Yeah. Um, And then just sort of saw us and, you know, I guess like jumped at the opportunity or whatever. But, bro, that freaked me out, dude. Don't worry. We can get you some new shoes. Okay, that's not going to be a big deal. All right. I'm taking us home. Uh, Sorry. I know this is private property, but I'm cutting over the land. <laughs> I'm not going to I'm not gonna sit and wait, okay? All right. We're good. Um, All right. Here. We'll help you inside. We'll get you an ice pack as well, and then uh, we'll sit you down on the couch for a little bit. Oh, my God. Okay. Dear God. God, dude, what a freaky experience that was.